Assalamu alaikum everyone, my name is Abdurrahman Rukman from Afghanistan and in this video I am going to show you 3 ways to recover deleted photos from iPhone or iPad. With these 3 methods you can also recover your deleted videos, messages, contacts and all the other files from your iPhone or iPad. So please watch this video till the very end because at the end of this video I am going to give you some tips to prevent any kind of data loss in the future. And also if you find this video helpful by any means then please share it with your friends. Come on guys, sharing is always free, it doesn't cost you anything. So with that being said, let's get started. Oh. As you can see here, I have an iPhone 7 in which I have a lot of photos. Now let me delete some photos from my phone so I can show you how you can get them back. So let's say I want to delete these photos and videos delete yes sir and i will also delete those photos from my iphone's recycle bin delete all now you can see now all my photos are gone our first method is using itunes backup to restore your deleted photos from your iphone for this your ios device must be backed up on itunes before deleting the photos so now let me show you how you can do that in order to restore deleted photos from itunes backup first of all connect your ios device to your pc or mac with a usb cable after that open itunes now click on your phone's icon after that all you need to do is restore backup now select the backup in which your photos are stored after that click on restore before you try this method remember few things first itunes doesn't allow you to restore files selectively which is not a good thing second it will restore everything that were backed up from your ios device and it will replace all the existing data that are already stored on your iphone which means you might lose some data from your iPhone. If you don't want to lose your existing data, then just skip this step and proceed to next ones. Okay, our second method is recovering deleted photos from iCloud account. Now, there are two ways to recover deleted photos from iCloud. First method is resetting your iPhone, which will erase all the data from your iPhone and it's very time consuming. Instead of showing that, I will show you an easiest way to recover all your deleted photos from your iCloud account if they were backed up. In order to do that, you need a computer with an internet connection. After that, open any browser you want. Then go to iCloud.com. Next, sign in with your Apple ID that you are using on your iPhone. So I'm just going to sign in. Next, go to your photos. Now select the photos that were deleted from your iPhone. So in case your photos are here, just select them and click on download and it will download your photos to your computer. As you can see, this is the photo. Our last method is using a data recovery software to recover deleted photos from your iPhone or iPad. If you don't have backup of your photos on your iPhone or iCloud, then you should try this method. So in this video, I'm going to use a data recovery software by the name of Tenoshare iPhone Data Recovery. You can get the software from the link given in the description below. This software is also available for Mac users. I know there are a lot of data recovery softwares out there. I will leave the link of all the data recovery softwares in the description below just in case you want to check it out. So just go ahead, download and install the software into your computer. After that, open it up. Okay, now connect your iPhone to your computer with a USB cable. Once your phone is connected, the software will automatically detect it. Now you have three options to recover deleted photos from. First option is recovering the data from the device itself. Second option is recovering from iTunes backup. This option is very handy if you have iTunes backup. This software will allow you to restore your deleted photos from iTunes backup selectively. And the third option is recovering files from iCloud backup. If you have backed up your photos to your iCloud, you can easily restore it using this software. And the third option is 
repair operating system if your iphone is uh, facing some problems like if your iphone is stuck on apple logo and something like that it will help you to fix those problems so in my case i'm going to recover data from my device itself so now select the type of files that you want to recover in my case i'm gonna select only photos you can unselect the second one because it will show all the existing data that are already stored on your iphone so in my case i'm gonna select only photos you can select whatever option you want from here after that click on start scan and it's gonna start scanning your device for deleted photos now this is gonna take time depending on how much photos you have deleted from your iphone so i'm just gonna pause the video over here and i will come back when it's done During this process, do not disconnect or use your phone. Just leave your phone as it is and grab a cup of coffee and have a good time. Okay, the scanning process is completed. As you can see, the software has found a lot of photos from my iPhone. Some of these photos were deleted even few months or few weeks back. So now select the photos that you want to recover. So in my case, I'm gonna select some photos. Once you're done with your selection, all you need to do is click on recover. Now select the place where you want to save. In my case, I'm gonna save it on this folder. After that, click on recover. Your recovered photos will be stored inside the folder. Now you can see these are the photos which were deleted from my iPhone. Okay, those were my three methods to recover deleted photos from an iPhone or iPad. Now let me give you some tips to prevent any kind of data loss in the future. My first tip for you is to back up your iPhone regularly. I've already made a separate video about backing up an iPhone or iPad. You can watch that video by clicking on i button at the top right corner or I will leave the link in the description below. In that video, I am showing three different ways to back up an iPhone or iPad. So make sure you watch that video after watching this one. My second tip for you is to use Google Photos to back up your iPhone's videos and photos. First of all, install Google Photos from iPhone's App Store, after that open it up. Google Photos is a cloud storage app which lets you back up your iPhone's photos and videos. Okay, when you open this app, as you can see, this app gives you two options to back up your photos. The first option is backing up your photos with high quality. If you choose this option, you can store as much photos as you want on your Google Photos account. It doesn't have any limitations. And the second option is backing up your photos with original quality. If you select the second option, it will give you only 14 gigabytes of storage to store your photos or videos. You can select whichever option you want. So in my case, I'm gonna go with second one because I want my photos to be backed up with its original quality. Once your storage is full, you can add another partner account to expand the storage, which is a very good idea. So I'm gonna select the second one and select your google account in which you want to back up your photos so in my case i'm going to use this account after that tap on confirm it's going to start backing up your iphone whenever your iphone is connected to the internet once your pictures are backed up on google photos you can access them anytime anywhere on any device in my opinion google photos is the best cloud storage for backing up your iphone photos or videos i've already used some other cloud storage apps like like dropbox or microsoft onedrive but they both will give you only 5 gigabytes to store your photos or videos so please let me know which one of these apps would you like to go for let me know in the comment section below so there you have it guys that is how you can recover deleted photos from your iphone or ipad i hope you guys learned something new from this video if you did then please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to share this video with your friends and if you want more videos like this then please subscribe to my channel with notification on and i'll catch you on the next one stay blessed